Hi, uh, we're representing Solax here today from Delray Beach, Florida and presenting to you the Renaissance UV ozone water treatment system. Uh, the uh, Renaissance is a, um, a, a patented configuration of two technologies that have been used for many years in the swimming pool industry and in uh, water treatment. Uh, this product is for swimming pools and is designed for use on in-ground swimming pools or residential pools uh, up to 35,000 gallons. So there are two processes that go on here and I'll show you how it uh, mounts up as we get further along. Uh, there are two components to the system. You have a power supply and you have the uh, manifold with the UV chamber itself. And what happens is, using your existing pool pump, we simply uh, mount this, this manifold by cutting about 12 inches of pipe and gluing this manifold in, and water coming from the pump and out of the filter, downstream of the filter, and downstream of the heater, enters the manifold. So what happens is, we control the flow through our, our chamber here. Uh, this is the actual chamber where the UV and ozone uh, sterilization and oxidation takes place is this top portion right above where you see my fingers and up inside here. We can handle from 20 gallons a minute up to 120 gallons a minute and it is diverted up into the chamber through a piece here called a Venturi fitting. And I'll, get, I'll circle back to how this is actually working um, as part of the whole process. But it comes up through this Venturi fitting and the water enters the chamber where it is exposed to ultraviolet light and ozone at the same time. The water comes uh, in this side of the chamber, moves across, and then moves back out of the chamber uh, through uh, this pipe into the T and then moves back to the pool uh, itself. Through this, uh, through this side of the manifold. Very simple to install, just a one cut, 12 inches wide. And this bulb does two things. It, it generates ultraviolet light at a very specific wavelength that will neutralize or neuter uh, organic material, viruses, bacteria, algaecide, any organic contaminants in the water. And uh, the UV light actually sterilizes them by neutering their DNA so they cannot reproduce. And uh, uh, then uh, the other function of that bulb is that it actually produces ozone. Uh, but it, uh, until now, that ozone has been wasted that has been generated by the UV bulb. We have discovered a way and patented a way to harvest that ozone as it's produced by the bulb. So the bulb is doing two things again, two things, uh, providing UV light and ozone. This is the UV bulb. And the way, it's the way it's inserted, it simply goes right into, into this side here. And there's a four pin connection going to your uh, power supply. And this bulb is encased in this quartz sleeve. And that little space there between the bulb and the sleeve, there's ozone gas being generated by the bulb. So what we do is, we, when water passes through this Venturi fitting, suction is created. So we're pulling the ozone gas as a gas. Uh, from inside that quartz sleeve here and it's being sucked by this venturi fitting and injected into the water flow as it enters the chamber. Now the interesting thing is that ultraviolet is a powerful water sterilization all by itself. Ozone is a powerful oxidizer of contaminants in water all by itself. But when you combine the two processes inside this chamber, it actually accelerates those, both of those processes where you're creating something called hydroxyl free radicals, which is a, a very fast acting, highly effective form uh, of, uh, of oxidation and sterilization that takes place in this chamber in milliseconds, microseconds. Uh, but the uh, net effect is that you get water that's absolutely perfectly distilled. Uh, the uh, power supply is a very uh, 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 interesting looking piece, uh, but there's, it's not just beautiful because it's meant to be beautiful. You can see that there's a blue light that glows and it just makes the uh, functionality um, uh, of the uh, power supply visible from a much greater distance. Uh, you don't have to go right up to the, uh, to the unit to see if it's working or not. Blue around the edge and here in the LED tells you the system is on and it's operating normally. 
If it's flashing blue here and here at the LED light, it means that there's no flow. We're, uh, we're, uh, we have a, uh, a dry fire protection uh, built into this system so that if there's no flow going through the unit, it automatically shuts down. And uh, if the unit lights red around the perimeter and a red uh, uh, LED, it means that there's a system error. Uh, the uh, value of being able to see this perimeter light is that you can see it through the bushes and, and see it uh, w in the equipment pad without having to get up close to see what's going on with it. So the system is very well conceived. It's been executed very well. The pricing is uh, about half of what you'd normally expect to pay for this type of uh, combined uh, uh, process. And it is available uh, by uh, and manufactured by Solax Incorporated in Delray Beach, Florida, sold through uh, pool wholesale distributors uh, and through selected dealers. Uh, uh, you can also go to our website, solax.com, to find out more about how Renaissance works. The last thing I would mention is that the unit is UL listed, the chamber is UL listed. Uh, the power supply has under undergone rigorous safety uh, tests as well and uh, carry certification, UL certification as well. Uh, perfectly safe, perfectly effective. And that's the Renaissance. We thank you from Solax in Delray Beach, Florida.